Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So, I've been thinking recently about my past jobs, current jobs of some individuals who I'm close to have, um, either have or have had. And there's one constant that I've noticed that seems to be a major problem, at least for us. Now bear in mind, as I talk about this, I'm not talking about every single location everywhere. But the... It's notorious for this, what I'm about to say anyway. I feel like restaurants and retail have kind of hit a very low point the past few years. They, when they started, I'm betting, I don't know if this is true or not, but I wouldn't be surprised that they had better customer service and better um, people working with them than they do now. But there are a lot, as I say a lot, I don't mean every single one of them, but there are a lot of locations that's considered fast food where either the owners or the like some kind of manager within the group just, just don't care. They don't care. They don't want to be there. When they get there, they lash out at everyone. And quite frankly, it's sad and disappointing when that kind of thing happens. Now, fast food restaurants nowadays, you would find a lot of people who work at them are usually those who are like going to school for something or just need extra money. For something like no barely anybody does it as a mainline job and the reason for this I feel like is what I'm talking about so many people who do it as a mainline job don't really care at least they don't act like they do when at the job itself and they, some of them pretend like they care but they don't by their actions their verbal words will say, okay, yeah, let's take care of it, blah, blah, blah. But once they get to the action part, they do nothing. Um, now, bear in mind, as I said before, this is not everywhere. This is kind of a gripe I have speaking for just not just myself, but people who I, am in, I, I keep in touch with. Um, even Amber. Like, recently, she's she has dealt with a man... She's been dealing with a manager who is so bad that everyone... Like, literally... And I talked about this in a previous video. She has a manager uh, who is so bad that apparently six different managers, all from different locations, do not like this guy at all. And that th this guy comes in and... If it was given the choice, if it was allowed, everybody would leave. Everybody would bail and leave the guy to vent, vent for himself. But the other problem with that is that if they did that, their stores would collapse. Not because they're not there, but because he, this person is there. And there are so many managers and or owners of chains, or not chains, but like branches... I guess is a better term of like different industries to the point where it's like no no none of them really care they're just there just to be there and if they could they would pretty much abandon ship leaving everybody to drown these are the kind of experiences I've had on multiple occasions when I used to work fast food there are the there there are circumstances that I've heard other people talk about be crap Amber, Aaron, and I have all discussed this in like in one general conversation before because all of us have dealt with people like this. But the problem for me, I feel like, is just that over time it just gets worse and worse and worse. I, I feel like if fast food industries ended up collapsing, those kind of people would be to blame. Because you lose customers from doing acting that way, whether it's towards the customer or towards the employee. It doesn't matter. Customer notices and then it gives off a bad environment. No one wants to be around that. In my mind, 
coming from someone who's who had worked fast food for about eight years, maybe more. Somewhere around that, at least. Maybe a little bit less, but I digress. Um, c coming from someone who's worked a long time in fast food, let's put it that way. I've seen it from both sides, and the customer is a big role in keeping a uh, fast food industry and retail um, in business. If a customer doesn't show up, how do they earn their wares? They can't. And that would cause a place to go bankrupt in the long haul because of all the bills that got to be paid. They won't get paid, so that'll end up causing bankruptcy in the long haul. But when you have, and it's I talk about it in fast food a lot because that's the experiences I've had with bad managers, but I know full well that retail is notorious for this kind of stuff. I'm, depending on the person, it's a different place, but still. It's, the, it's that way one way or the other. And it's, as I said, it's just really sad. It's sad and pathetic that people can't just treat their employees good goodly in a goodly manner it'd be kind of nice if someone would actually do that would consider that and every now and then these industries do end up with managers who actually do care who look out for the others that's one of the major reasons why i was able to hang on to fast food for as long as i did but eventually that snapped um but just the only reason i held on so long is because of these rare extremely rare good managers and co-workers but if these people did not exist I guarantee the only stores that would exist would be online and online only everywhere else screw it no no one would show up customer or consumer depending on the term you like to use um, and employee alike none of them would show ever this is the problem that's been going on for a while with those two particular types of industries. Fast food, regular restaurant, or retail, you name it, there's always that idiotic manager who seems, or higher up kind of character, or sometimes just co-worker in general, who seems to act like they own the place. And they'll treat everyone else as if they're way below them. And each location that has ever done this gets shunned big time. It's a gripe I've always had for a long time, and I guess I'm just speaking up because I know not many people will. Um, but I guess this is just something, since I don't work in that industry anymore, it can't impact me in any kind of way whatsoever. Um, and since, you know... Barely anybody watches these videos right now, as of this recording anyway. It, I doubt the word's going to get out in time for anything bad to happen outside of this. But anyway, I don't know. What do you guys think? Have you guys had any experiences like this with any jobs you guys have had before? Uh, if so, let me know in the comments below. If you like this video or agreed with anything I have said here today, make sure to push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. Oh, jeez. My finger's acting weird. Or the camera's just at a distance. Um, if you really like this kind of thing, uh, consider subscribing to the channel. And why not check out the rest of the Discussion Rant playlist where you'll find it on this side of my head. Or if that's not floating your boat quite, click the link on the other side where you'll find something that YouTube recommends for you. But in the meantime, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for tuning in for this video, everyone. And I hope to see all of you in another. Catch you guys later.